one's going to be an interesting for you, folks. So what we have is my snow tech. What is that? Arenals? Aries? Aaron's? Anyways, um, probably about a couple weeks ago, I discovered that I was having a hard time shooting out the snow. And also, I was getting black coming out of it. So, <laughs> uh, looking into it, it looks like I need a belt replacement. So, I went online and found the belt. Then I uh, bought it over at Home Depot. Picked it up for like 13 bucks or something like that. Price isn't really relevant. All I know is that it can range. I've seen them range from $40 all the way over to, well, $13.96. So, that gives you an idea of how so many places are overcharging for it. And it's colder than hell out here. I believe it's like... No, let me check my phone. 16 degrees. Yeah, 16 degrees out. That's what we got going on for that. And because I got tools out from the bike still, I figure, you know what, let's take care of this problem right now. don't exactly have a manual, so I'm winging it. fail safe. A lot of things you'll learn. So if the propane torch gets knocked over, it automatically cuts off. Sweet. happens to have a flywheel it's got a tensioner on here you can see all this black that's from the belt I was having a hard time pushing the snow the other day in fact I'm gonna give you a real up close turn on the freaking light there we go you can see all that that's from the belt socket wrench already hit the 13 millimeter on there so loosen this up Lucy, ah. fall maintenance or winter maintenance, things in which I detest the most, but it happens. I 
Luckily, it'll just come right off. If I didn't know this, it would have been a hell of a lot easier than running in my car when I originally bought this. Just undo this, and we can temporarily separate. I'm very mechanically fine. I mean, I had 
you guys were expecting unloaded class. They slacked off a lot. It's like they weren't even in class half the time. They actually went into my car one time and stole my, stole my wallet. Tried using my uh, ATM card when I realized what was going on. I informed my instructor. Canceled, called up my bank, canceled my card. And I'm not an idiot. I mean, I don't put pin numbers on my fucking card. And yes, I do have relatives that do that. Oh wait, no, not relatives. I've known people. That's just like putting your password underneath your keyboard. Yes, I have come across that so many times. Yeah, I have come across the first place I look. If I use this one, I think that's going to put underneath the keyboard. What do you know? There's your password. Hey, you're an idiot. Don't do that. Please don't do that. Security risk. Thing always on. Jess from her two wheels was lucky enough to be able to go down to Florida, hang out with Blockhead and his crew. I envy her. <laughs> I mean, I got relatives down over in Florida myself. I would really like to go, but my wife is afraid of COVID, so there goes that. She won't do it until maybe next year. Me, on the other hand. I'm actually a fairly healthy guy, despite having the heart disease right inside the family. Everything looked aligned. Looked like nothing was in the way. I'm not going to force you to watch me uh, snow below the driveway. I wouldn't do that to you. I did that already in one video. <laughs> Alright, so I <laughs> hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, I'm Wild Rider. Stay safe. And I'll see you in the next ride.